All right, welcome back. I know I'm a few days late talking about this, but like I still just needed to talk about it. Joel Embiid had an all-time performance. I mean, best performance of the season by far. One of the best performances out of like the last couple seasons. Like this is like a like a all-time historic performance by him and just in general. Joel Embiid had 59 points, 11 rebounds, 8 assists, and seven blocks. I mean, that's flirting with a, that's a near, you're flirting with a with a 60 point quadruple double, and he had five of those blocks in the fourth quarter. He dropped like 24, 26 points in the in the fourth quarter alone. Like he was just, he was just so dominant. Like this is just, this has to be one of the most dominant games in history just on both ends of the floor, the way he just controlled the offense and the defense. I mean, seven blocks is impressive. 59 points is impressive, and then he also had eight assists, meaning meaning like he was passing the ball. There were some really nice passes I saw, like the backdoor cut Tobias had, and he just just on a string to him. Um, there was another pass where he got doubled and Shake was left wide open at the rim, and he just quickly got it to him. There was just, he was just in complete control and he was just so dominant in this game. And he missed four free throws, which is crazy because there, there are nights where Joel will not miss a free throw. Like he'll go like 15 for 15 or 14 for 14, 16 for 16, like that. He went 20 for 24. So like if he, had, he if, if he had made just like one more free throw, he would have had that 60 point game, which would have been awesome. But 59 points is like, that's just ridiculous. And it took it took a couple weeks to get the first 50-point game of the season. And Darius Garland got it. And then a couple hours later, Joel Embiid does this. And it's just incredible. Like, Joel Embiid is one of the best players in the league. And I think people, they, they kind of forget about that. There was a lot of people... There was a lot of people clowning Embiid and like saying like, oh, he's not good at the start of the season because he had a slow start. But I think he just proved a lot of people wrong. And I'm I'm curious to see how well the Sixers will continue to do uh, with the rest of the time that James Harden is out because that is just, I'm just still in awe of that performance. And it's just ridiculous. Like, that's that's a 2K stat line, a near 60-point quadruple-double. Like, that's just, that's crazy. And I'm curious to see what happens next game. But yeah, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel for more content, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.